My name is Spencer Keough. I'm a clinical veterinarian at the Denver Zoo Conservation Alliance, and I'm a board-certified zoological veterinarian. So Hesty and some of her family members got into a little scuffle, uh, and she sustained some injuries to her hands, feet, and her left elbow. Um, scuffles aren't super common in orangutans, but they do happen, and they're a natural part of their behavior and social structure, both in the wild and in zoological institutions. Uh, and so that led to us then doing an exam to evaluate those injuries. Our veterinary team is more than capable of doing a lot of soft tissue and orthopedic surgery. However, because Hesty's hands are so much like human hands, and because we want her to have the high level of dexterity that she needs and the highest chance of success and full return to function, we decided to reach out to local hand and complicated elbow surgeons that work on people here in Denver. And so that's what led to me reaching out to Denver Health and Dr. Andrew Martins. Um, to see if we could get his assistance in her surgery. So Dr. Martins, Dr. Churchill, and Dr. Kaczynski and their whole orthopedic surgery team came and joined us here at Denver Zoo Conservation Alliance. And our team basically ran the procedure. We anesthetized Hesty. We brought her up here to the hospital. And our team consisted of all of our veterinary technicians as well as our veterinarians. And so I was scrubbed in with Andrew during the surgery while the rest of our vet team was managing her anesthesia and all of her treatments. And that way, if there were any species specific questions that came up, I could address those and we could talk about them together in the moment. Across our field, we often utilize specialists in other fields, um, both human and veterinary, so that we can at least, the main goal being provide our patients with the best care possible. So partnerships like we had with Dr. Martins um, and the hand and elbow surgery team from Denver Health are fairly common. This was our first time working with him and his team, um, but definitely if we have any other complicated hand or elbow orthopedic surgeries in primates, he'll be the first person I reach out to. They did fantastic work. Hesty is much happier now that she's in the full recovery phase and she's back with Jaya and her family members. She's moving her limbs a lot better and we're just kind of watching her um, throughout this recovery process to make sure all her function comes back to normal. And so the current thing we have on the docket is training her for some voluntary x-rays so we can check those repaired fractures to make sure they all still look good. The Helen and Arthur E. Johnson Animal Hospital is a fantastic addition to Denver Zoo and I feel incredibly fortunate to be here and be able to work in this space. It's also on public display, so we have the public who can actually see us in our different treatment rooms, the small animal treatment, large animal treatment, the operating room, as well as the laboratory, and I think it gives us um, a unique ability to connect with the public and the guests and show them the level of care we provide our animals and the amount of work that goes into caring for these animals. So that transparency I think really helps with public understanding and um, public support for Denver Zoo.